Hello everybody, so I'm going to read you a story today and it's called The World Made a Rainbow. All of the world had to stay at home today. I wish that I didn't have to. I want to play. I missed everybody. My grandma, my friends. My mum said, you'll see them once everything mends. Let's paint a big rainbow to put on display. When people pass by and see it, they'll say, all rainstorms must end and this rainstorm will too. And they'll feel a bit happier, all thanks to you. So we dig out some paint pots. I love making art. We've got lots of red so I can make a good start. But red makes me think of the chairs in my class. Mum gives me a cuddle. This rainstorm will pass. I can't reach the orange, but Mum has to work. And Dad's with my brother, who's going berserk. I'll start on the yellow. It's bright like the sun. I splodge it around with the red. It's good fun. I've made my own orange, I, but I can't make green. I need blue for that, and the blue pot's wiped clean. I'll start to feel lonely. I start to feel sad and then how about odd bits of cardboard says dad he cuts a nice stick and my brother helps too we have to mix flour and water for glue it looks really good like the ocean says mum and all the adventures we have still got to come the seaside the city the forest the park. The light couldn't shine if it never knew dark. And rainbows can't colour the world without rain. So we got back to work on my rainbow again. I've never been quite sure what indigo's like. Dad laughs indigo like your very first bike. And I dig out a memory box I've never seen, packed with memories from places we've been. I shout indigo as I spot my mum's jeans. Well, I can't cut them up so we can use magazines. Then dad takes a snapshot for Gran and I say, memories are good, we'll make more every day. My rainbow looks great. They're, there's just violet to go. Violet, the loveliest person I know. Violet's my best friend. I miss her so much. Mum fetches her laptop. Let, let's put you in touch. And would you believe Violet feels just like me and she's making a rainbow for people to see. We walk to see hers and she walks to see mine and we wave at each other and really it's fine. Not perfect but neither's my rainbow. So what? I'm perfectly happy with all that I've got. Violet, my parents, my brother, my friends. And we still have each other when the rainstorm ends. And I think that is a lovely story all about why some children are at home and some children are at school. Wouldn't it be lovely if you could all paint a rainbow or create a rainbow and then when we all come back together, when all schools are allowed to be open again and we all come together, we could put all our rainbows up to show that we are back together again, just like we wanted to. Take care, everybody. Thank you for listening.